facelift is when I surgically reverse the signs of aging in a single procedure that lasts over a decade. The main complaints my patients who end up ultimately choosing to receive a facelift have are that they notice shadows that weren't there when they were younger. Deep nasal labial folds, marionette lines, jowling, deep circles underneath their eyes. And what these are are fixed areas where the transitions of our normal anatomic areas, fixed areas from mobile areas. In order to correct those, you have to surgically free everything up and restore it back to restore that youthful heart shape. That's one of the problems with non-surgical corrections is if you're going to fill volume to blend those transitions, you start adding volume in places you didn't have them in your youth. And in female faces, you can masculinize the jaw by overfilling these areas, trying to blend jowls. Surgical correction actually looks a lot more natural because it looks like it did when it was younger instead of unnatural overfilling. So how do I perform facelifts? I do extended deep plane facelifts. And the simplest way of saying that is more traditional or older forms of doing facelifts, they used to just undermine the skin and pull it real tight. And a way of thinking about that is grabbing a tree branch by the leaves. The leaves aren't that strong. If you actually grab the base of the branch, the leaves come along with it in a tension-free way. In deep plane facelifts, correct facial aging much in the same way. When you go in the deep plane and grab those deeper structures after freeing all of the ligaments, everything comes in a very smooth, easy way and naturally positions where it did when you were younger in life. The skin, just like the leaves on a tree, just get trimmed by excess, but the deeper foundation of it is what's been corrected. Even in the neck, whenever you have platysmal bands, by freeing the skin off of that muscle, then grabbing that muscle and pulling it tight, you're able to restore that clean angle of the jaw you did before. And many times, I'm able to do it all hidden from back here without even making an extra cut underneath the chin.